Make a Lotto Game Board with Google Docs by Jennifer Mitchell, speech language pathologist. You can make a Lotto Game Board using either Google Documents or Google Presentation. Your board will be available to edit any time or to print from any computer. You can also make it public with, for others to use. It only takes 5 to 10 minutes or even less. This presentation includes step-by-step -step directions using Google Documents to create a Lotto Game Board. If you have a Google Gmail account, then you automatically have an account on Google Drive. If you haven't used it, then go to docs.google.com and log in using your Gmail account. Once you are in your Google Drive, select Create and in the drop-down select Document. A new tab will open with your document. Select Untitled Document at the top left corner and rename your new file. Don't worry about saving anything. Google automatically saves everything for you. Place a table on the slide by selecting Table on the toolbar. Move your cursor across the cells to add the number of rows and columns you want. Let's start with a 4x4. Four four. To make the table cells equal in size, change the table properties. On the toolbar, go to Table and select Table Properties. In the dialog box, change the column width to 1.5 and the row height to 1.5. I like everything centered, so change cell vertical alignment to center and table alignment to center. Now you are ready to put pictures on the table. This is my favorite part because it is quick and easy. Google will allow us to find images in the Google search then drag and place them into a cell without leaving the document. To open the search, go to the toolbar and select Tools. Then select Research. Once the research box is open on the right side, click on the inverted triangle and the drop down and select Images. Type a keyword in the search box and press Enter. I like using clip art instead of photos, so type clip art and the keyword. You will get many choices, so scroll down to view more. Of course, if you plan on selling your lotto board, you should only select copyright free images using the filter. You can also use your own library of images by inserting them or using the copy and paste function. When you have decided on an image that you would like to use, select the image, then drag and place it into the table cell. The image should be the right size because we changed the table properties, but if you need to change the size of the image, select the corner and drag. If you see a number in the table cell after adding the image, just delete it. Continue finding pictures for your board until you have it completed. To share it with others, select the Share button in the top right corner and change the settings. To see this Lotto board online, select the googly hyperlink. And if you want your own copy to edit, just go to File and select Make a Copy, and then you will find it in your own Google Drive.